I see. So the Aramia and her crew were... But why? There's nothing unusual. Something definitely happened on the Aramia, sir. The surviving crewmen said as much. And then, there's the matter of the unidentified life form we encountered out there on the beach. I believe there must be some connection between them. Supreme Commander Gagan, may I request an analysis of this object? Very well, I'll see to it. The matter interests us greatly. So, were you surprised? About the aliens, or rather, extraterrestrials. Surprised is not the word, sir. Just look at this base they're constructing. Indeed. All of this is thanks to the Aldarian's scientific capabilities. Sir, you were aware of their existence, weren't you? USTA Command and we captains were, yes. So Crow knew, too. He's good at that. You never can tell what secrets he's hiding. Unlike someone I know who's like an open book. Cute. <laughs> with matters being as they are, we've decided to join with the Eldarians in a co-exploration effort. USTA Headquarters has approved the plan. Consider yourselves informed. Sir. Understood. Effective immediately. I would like you to form a composite team with FaZe here. FaZe may be young, but he has incredible potential. What he mainly lacks is experience, and this will be an excellent opportunity for him to gain some. If it's not too much trouble, may I ask you to work with him? It's far from trouble, sir. He saved our lives with his powers. It was almost like magic. Ah, uh, yes. Symbology. That is but one of FaZe's many talents. I do hope you'll help me in bringing out the rest of them. Yes, sir. Looking forward to it. And I. You all must be tired from your efforts. Feel free to get some rest. Come talk to me when you're ready to accept your next assignment. Yes, sir. Whoa! <clears throat> Out of my way, civilian. What? What's with him? He's scary. That uniform. He must be with the 13th Eldarian Independent Armored Division. A captain, it would seem. I've never seen him before. But you don't hear very nice rumors about the 13th. <sighs> Man, that guy means business. Okay, uh, before we actually go over and uh, take a rest, um, we want to do uh, one of the sub-quests here. Um, it's actually really short to do, in fact, uh, we don't really have to go do anything as long as uh, we have 10 insect legs and 10 insect eggs, so... It is very useful after you accept uh, one of these things to talk to them again right away because you might already have what they're looking for in your inventory and if you do then you won't have to go anywhere else to find it so you'll save yourself a whole bunch of time doing it that way. Oh, 
You're right. Let's keep this up. I can't keep being a nuisance forever. Oh, okay, so it's eight, not ten, but... Oh well. You probably get ten anyway, because, uh... That if you get eight with this one, and, uh... You figure out, oh wait, it's eight with this, or... Eight with this one, and not the last one, but... Oh well. I have plenty anyway, so... <laughs> yeah, let's try really hard. Oh wait, they're here already. Oh, come on! Give me something really good. Oh, thank you. I'm, I'm hoping this is really good. Considering the last two items were crap, so... Ooh. Well, actually, it is a bonus, so... Okay. Now, I'm gonna go over and talk to everybody else, um... Then I'm going to, uh, go rest again, um... Make sure that I'm not saving over anything anymore, so... Um... I will, uh, just meet you up on the bridge again, uh, Ready to talk to Captain Crafton, so... I will, uh, be right back. <laughs>